I'm Juliette Brody. I'm a professor at Stanford Law School, and I'm the director of the Stanford Community Law Clinic in East Palo Alto, which is a place where I supervise law students in doing civil legal services cases for low-income people on the peninsula. Rent stabilization is an anti-displacement strategy. It protects your tenants during an era or a period in time when the market is so hot that landlords could otherwise jack up rents and displace tenants who cannot afford those rents. Before there was rent control in Mountain View, there was just an incredible number of stories of people who were getting enormous rent increases, 50, 60, 100% rent increases with a 30-day or 60-day notice. Measure V, the CSFRA, includes something called a decontrol trigger, which says if the vacancy rate in the city of Mountain View goes above 5%, the Rental Housing Committee can look at the market conditions and elect to turn off rent control. The theory being, we need rent control when market conditions are so hot that tenants are at grave risk of displacement. Turning off rent control at something less than 5% would expose tenants to displacement risks again and leaving tenants at the mercy of a still hot market. 